Nickel is back with me getting ready to tackle some transfer rumors that have tackle. been swirling around. Yes, Stevie, we know how much you love to tackle them. Davi Luiz to Real Madrid. Would that be a hit or a miss for him? Um, it would be a miss for him. Um, I don't see how he would play. Um, Varane uh, and Ramos pretty much are ensconced in that central defensive position. Uh, I don't see him playing in the middle of the park either. Um, Casimero for me is another one who's ensconced in the middle of the park. So I just don't see this happening at all. I, I think this is a miss. And I will move it over to the miss column for you. Richarlison, everyone's been talking about this Brazilian. He's been mm. linked with Tottenham. He's been linked with Chelsea. So would him leaving Watford be a hit or a miss for him? Um, if he... For the miss column. For you, Richarlison, everyone's been talking about this Brazilian. He's been mm. linked with Tottenham. He's been linked with Chelsea. So would him leaving Watford be a hit or a miss for him? Um, if he keeps producing the performances that he has done so far this season, then I think eventually he keeps... ...producing the performances that he has done so far this season, then I think eventually, yes. Uh, I think any suitors are probably watching to see whether he, whether he can keep this up, whether he can be consistent for the whole season. And if he does, I wouldn't be surprised to see him leaving. So I think eventually it's a hit. If he wants to. <laughs> He's a bit hesitant there. I'm sure Marco <laughs> Silva would be hesitant to let him go as yes. well. Emre Chan to Juventus. Uh, makes a lot of sense. Um, I think, yeah, I think he would fit in very well at Juventus. Uh, it's a bit of a strange one that that he has let his contract uh, run down. It's strange that Liverpool have let him exactly. run it Exactly. But if he doesn't want to sign it, then there's nothing they can do. So I think there's a possibility of this happening. Um, to me, he's a guy who isn't quite a constant in the Liverpool side, and I'm not sure whether he's happy with that. This up with He can be consistent for the whole season and if he does I wouldn't be surprised to see him leaving so I think eventually it's a hit if he wants to <laughs> he's a bit hesitant there I'm sure Marco <laughs> Silva would be hesitant to let him go as yes. well Emre Chan to Juventus uh, makes a lot of sense um, I think yeah I think he would fit in very well at Juventus uh, it's a bit of a strange one that that he has let his contract uh, run down. It's strange that Liverpool have let him exactly. run it Exactly. But if he doesn't want to sign it, then there's nothing they can do. So I think there's a possibility of this happening. Mm. Um, to me, he's a guy who isn't quite a constant in the Liverpool side, and I'm not sure whether he's happy with that. I'm going to say this is a hit. I think I can see him leaving. So, Mr Chan, I'm going to say this is a hit. I think I can see him leaving. So, Mr. Chan, get yourself over here. All right, now let's group these two together because mm. this has been the talk of the town for some time now. Mesut Ozil and Alexis Sanchez, we know their contract situation at Arsenal. Arsene Wenger has come out and said they're not going anywhere, mm. but we know Wenger does say some things that possibly aren't true. Mm. Do you pick them to leave in January, and would it be hits for them? Um, I just don't see any way possible or any reason why Arsenal would let these two leave. Um, I suppose they both I don't want think, to leave. I don't think Arsenal's desperate for money. Certainly money talks, but I think they would have an absolute revolt on their hands with the fans if they let any of them go, never mind the two of them. So I really don't...
get yourself over here. All right, now let's group these two together because this has been the talk of the town for some time now. Mesut Ozil and Alexis Sanchez, we know their contract situation at Arsenal. Arsene Wenger has come out and said they're not going anywhere, mm. but we know Wenger does say some things that possibly aren't true. Mm. Do you pick them to leave in January and would it be hits for them? Um, I just don't see any way possible or any reason why Arsenal would let these two leave. Um, I suppose they both I don't want think, to leave. I don't think Arsenal's desperate for money. Certainly money talks, but I think they would have an absolute revolt on their hands with the fans if they let any of them go, never mind the two of them. So I really don't see any way possible that either of these two leave whatsoever. I just don't see it. Especially in January. That I don't see any way possible that either of these two leave whatsoever. I just don't see it. Especially in January. That would be absolutely shocking be for crazy. Arsene it Wenger. It would be crazy. So we're going to go with what Arsene Wenger says and we're going to put for this once. as this is. For once. Thanks for so once. much to Stevie Dinkle. Continue tracking all of these transfer rumors here on ESPNFC.com.